Hello everybody and welcome to another tutorial for the Lionshare Tron Smart Contract. This tutorial is how to import your Tron wallet to your Tron link. Yes, we have heard today that we do need that Tron link app in order to connect to the Lionshare contract. And that's perfectly fine. If you've started out with Tron wallet, no worries. We can definitely get that wallet imported so that you can access that one wallet with both apps, the Tron wallet and the Tron link. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up my Tron wallet just like this. And I'm going to put in my password, if I can do it right. There we go. And I'm going to navigate to that wallet, the wallet that I want to import. Okay? Very easy here. All we're going to do is hit the settings button down in the lower right-hand corner. Choose backup wallet. It's going to ask me for my password. And it's going to give me a security alert. I'm going to hit OK. And then here, I'm going to push these two little pages right there until it says copied to clipboard. Then I'm going to navigate to my TronLink wallet where you will see that there's a wallet there already. But I'm going to push this little add button up in the upper right hand corner and then choose private key. Now that's going to bring up this box here where I'm just going to tap in it and I'm going to paste that private key from my Tron wallet into Tron link. I'm going to hit next step. I'm going to wait for it to load. Here it is just reading everything, making sure that it can access that. It's going to ask me for a name and so you can name it anything you want to. You're going to hit next step, and then it's going to ask you for a password. Now, there are some criteria for that password, but as long as all of those check marks are green, you should be good to go. It's then going to ask you to verify that password. I'm just going to carry that out, and lo and behold, it's importing the wallet, and there we go. Now, how do you know if it's truly imported? I mean, in this case, I have no Tron, so the wallet is empty. When you do have Tron in it, so let's say you had, you know, 100,000 100, shares of Tron, that 100,000 shares would now show up in both places. But in order to really check, just check the receive address. So you can see this one is TKFVNF all the way through and then RWF at the end. And if I log back or go back into my Tron wallet and I'm going to choose the back arrow, I'm going to choose my wallet, I'm going to see that it gives me the same address TKFVN all the way down RWF. And that is what you're looking for. So now I am looking at the same wallet on both the Tron Wallet app, as well as the Tron Link app, which means that I can now access Lionshare quickly and easily from either of them. But again, according to James Ward this, this afternoon in his message, the Tron Link is the one you're going to need to get that authorization into the contract. Hopefully this answers your questions, and obviously, if not, please get in touch with your sponsor, the person that brought you into uh, this opportunity, this blessing, and uh, they will be able to help you out. Thanks again, and have a great night.